Hello, this is Nori Job and welcome to a Ultimate Team Player Review. And today we have got an Inform player from this week's Team of the Week. We have got Inform Yakonan, and he plays for Hanover 96 in the Bundesliga. He's from the Ivory Coast as well. We'll take a look at his card face that there you can see on the screen. It's 84 pace, 83 dribbling, 80 shooting, 45 defending, 71 passing, and finally 72 heading. So overall, those card face stats make him look like a complete uh, overall good player. He's in a right forward position. Uh, his inform original card is in the right mid position, but I did want to convert him into a right forward just to try and get the most out of him in game, and he definitely does perform in game. So now you can see the prices: Xbox 20k, PlayStation 3 20k, and PC 28k. So a pretty cheap player. His price might even drop a tiny bit more because he is still in packs up until Wednesday, but his price will probably settle about the prices you can see on the screen. So his key in-game stats, there you can see all of his in-game stats, but the ones I picked out were 87 finishing, 87 dribbling, 89 long shots, 89 88 reactions and finally 86 sprint speed it's a high attacking work rate and medium defensive work rate which is pretty nice for a right forward also he has a four star weak foot and three star skills so that's very very nice if he had four star skills that would be uh, an added bonus but three star skills is pretty decent as well so now we can uh, have a look at some of the goals i scored i scored nine goals in eight games which is pretty nice uh, for a player as well in the right forward position they do often swap uh, swap sorry with the striker so that didn't matter too much but here you can see uh, one of the first goals i scored with yakonam Great bit of skill, the nice roulette, good cutting inside with the fake shot. A decent shot, however, the keeper saved, but Shirley was there. Just uh, tapped that in. So let's go and talk about a bit more about some of his other good in-game stats. So first of all, he has some very, very good sprint speed. 86 sprint speed, 85 ag uh, acceleration, and 86 agility. Combined with the 85 balance and 83 ball control, make him very, very good. A very, very quick and alert player. who can definitely sprint away from uh, the oncoming defenders. And he also has uh, 68 strength, and that combined with the balance he isn't always going to get pulled and pushed around from the defenders he can sometimes shrug them off and uh, hopefully sprint away with his good sprint speed so that is one really good plus point about Yakon a very very quick player very very good and here you can see an example of his shot power we'll talk about that now 85 shot power 89 long shots, 87 finishing, 82 penalties, and 82 volleys. And that was an example of a cracking half volley right into that top left-hand corner. And there you can see Yakono gets another goal right into that top right-hand corner. So it's very, very good uh, shot power. Very, very deadly. Very, very good at finishing as well. It's going to be very unlikely that he is going to miss the target because he is so good. Really deadly. And one of his shot, uh, sorry, his overall shot power just make him amazing. Here you can see decent penalty right into that top of the net. And very, very good. So now let's go and talk about some other game stats we'll talk about his dribbling now it's very very good 87 dribbling it's really noticeable i quite enjoyed his dribbling as well i don't know if you guys find this but i find if you're a smaller player about like five eight like yakanan is um you can actually uh dribble a lot better so that's one good point that i found with his dribbling also his passing 58 long passing isn't amazing but the 80 short passing it makes him very very good to link up with the left forward and the uh, striker as well his heading is only five for eight but he uh, has 81 jumping which is not too bad 68 heading isn't too good but the overall 81 jumping make him pretty nice as well so that is all of his in-game stats are covered and now let's go on to the overview part so First of all, the good points. He has amazing dribbling. As I said, very, very good. Very quick player. 83 ball control. 87 dribbling. Make him very, very nice. Good first touch. And he can definitely dribble his way around some defenders. Quick, agile player, as I said. Very good sprint speed. Very, very good uh, acceleration as well. Definitely sprint away from the defenders. And he has a very, very good solid shot. I haven't really noticed too much about his long shot. But definitely, if you're in and around the box, you can definitely finish it off 99% of the time. And also, his short passing is nice as well. His bad stats are only three-star skills. Doesn't matter too much. The four-star weak foot does help him a lot. And the low aggression, he has a uh, below 60 in aggression. So sometimes, he doesn't want to intercept the ball. But overall, I found him a really pleasant to play with a very very good player and overall i recommend that you guys go ahead and try him out very very cheap play on both consoles and a real bargain as well so thanks for watching guys if you guys want me to review any more players that you're interested uh, in looking at then make sure you leave a comment down below i have a budget of 500k so any player i will take a look at and see if i'd like to review them or not here you can see some uh, previous videos that I've uploaded in the past week. We've got a Norwich commit career mode video and also a squad build as well. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this. Five likes would be amazing. See you next time. Goodbye.